Look at Joshua Griffin will kick it off for the Jaguars. And we are underway at Mumford Stadium. The kick carries deep into the end zone, and the Cowboys will bring it out. Across the 20, he has some open room, and it's the foot race now down the sidelines. Cuts back over the middle, all the way down the field. What a return by Mason Pierce, and he takes it all the way, the opening kickoff. Pierce returns it for a touchdown for the Cowboys, and just like that, McNeese State breaks out in front. Down and about five to go for Southern. Fake the handoff, keeps on the rollout, has a man inside, a completed pass in the first down. On the play for the Jaguars, that is number five making the catch. A nice play. Tied second and short again for the Jaguars. The toss to Ben this time. Some room on the outside, and he is upended there. And we see it every day at practice. And he said last week people got to see it on the field for the first time in a long time, but he has a lot of confidence in him. Skelton, again, on second down, throwing deep this time. Has a man wide open. And it's going to be a touchdown for the Jaguars. A nice play to Travis Tucker on the play. Somehow he got open in that McNeese second secondary and took it in for the touchdown. Fourth down, bad snap. It gets away from Ogeron. He hustles back and he does the smart thing by falling on the football. But uh, there was a lot of uh, mix-up going on. A lot of things weren't exactly straight on that play. And I was second down and goal to go. Skelton fakes to his left, throws to his right as a man wide open, and that's a touchdown to Devon Ben. And just like that, the Jaguars break out in front. Give some, give some time. First down, and it goes to Pierce coming around, and Pierce is showing off that speed again that he showed off on the opening kickoff, and what a big return. This time, Ogeron hands off inside to Hutterson and Hutterson still on his feet banging forward and he is close to another first down. And Jordan Lewis on that tackle. He's make, starting to make a presence here. First there and he 10 is. and that is Jordan Lewis from behind. What a job. He is so quick around the edge. It is so tough to contain that guy. That is what he does back with a sack on Cody Ogeron. Snap from center is good. The hold is good and his kick. Splits the upright, so the Cowboys are on the board. Decent team, so I know a couple of those guys were on the offensive line, and we're getting a good look at why they made that all-swag team. Are ready to play ball. Second down, the pitch coming wide right, and that's Nelson again diving forward. 46-yard line. And that's Devon Ben spinning and twisting inside, and he's close to another first down. The one who actually got to his feet early. Yeah, Chambers was the one who dove back inside to make the stop. So this time, a little razzle-dazzle coming up from the Jaguars. Skelton fires it deep, has a man wide open, and it's a touchdown to Ethan Howard for the Southern Jaguars touchdown. Nothing like the reverse flea flicker, right? 17 pounds from Waller, Texas, is in the ball game, and he's going to throw it. Fires a pass, and he completes a pass. A nice job right there. He throws a strike to Josh Matthews, and that's a first down for the Cowboys. Wilson told us he had several offensive linemen injured in the LSU game, and that gave him some problems. And this time, the Jaguars come up with a sack, and guess who it was? Jordan Howard. You had to have an idea when you see someone flash that quickly in the backfield and come up with a big play. So, high snap. Bartlett fires over the middle. Had it in Mason Pierce's hands, but he cannot hang on. It's going to be an incomplete pass, and that will turn it over back to the Jaguars. And the word from Matthew Bonnet, the SID at McNeese, he said Cody Ogeron will return in the second half, and that is Skelton right there, and he is nailed on the keeper. Not much going on on that play. 14 in the first half, 160 yards. This time, the pass goes out to the outside, and a fine play by Jamar Washington, and he's going to pick up a first down. The ball resting on the 30-yard line. Skelton has a nice little pocket. Fires high, and it's intercepted by the Cowboys. Still on his feet, and they're going to return it all the way back to the 25-yard line, and there's also a flag on the play to go with it. Right about the 14-yard line. Ogeron hands inside to Hutterson, and he dives in for the touchdown, and the Cowboys... First play after the turnover, they're on the board, and that's going to make it a new game. 21-17.
as the Cowboys go on the attack. Ogeron with the pass to Mason Pierce. And Pierce once again turns in a big play for the Cowboys. The third quarter, and we come back to live action, and it's Hutterson again. He hurdled one guy, and then he's finally knocked down right there at about the 11-yard line. But he broke free on that one, put some more points on the board again. Ogeron looking to pass, floats it into the end zone, and it's almost picked off. Good coverage over there by the Southern Jaguars. A 25-yard field goal for the Cowboys. Nice snap, good hold. His kick goes up, and it's true. Ogeron looks like he's trying to change the play. Has McMahon, pitches the ball, and he goes to the big guy, Williams. Ogeron in trouble, and he escapes. He got away. He looked like he was going to be sacked, stayed on his feet. And let's see whether or not they mark the receiver in bounds. The pass was completed to number 80. This game, another big down, third down, goal to go for McNeese. The pass in the back of the end zone, that's Matthews. He was trying to work him. Got Matthews open for the touchdown, and he made the catch there, and McNeese will move out in front. So here we go, the two-point conversion. Ogeron rolling right, throws inside, has his man. That is Pierce right there, Mason Pierce for the two-point conversion. And the Cowboys move out in front, 28 to 21. Confused on this panel. Third and five. They go heavy to the right side. Tries to flip it into the backfield. The ball is down there, maybe a live ball. None of the Jaguars got on the football, but the Cowboys did recover it. And let's see what the officials say. They're talking about this. It's, it's McNeese's ball. Apparently, that was a ball thrown backwards. It was a backwards pass. Ogeron will throw it. Had some pressure. Had to step out of the pocket. Fires it inside. It's a completed pass, and that's a first down for McNeese. In that red zone, Ogeron looking to throw it again. Had pressure on the right side. This time, he scrambles out of the pocket. So here comes Abel again for a 27-yard field goal attempt. Jacob Abel. Kick is up, and he splits the upright, so the Cowboys have tacked on three more. Skelton on second down, dumps it off short. On the right side has Craig Nelson. Nelson, we know he's explosive because Coach said that's what he can do. With these Cowboys out in front, 31-21, to 21, and the handoff goes over there to Nelson. Excuse me, that is... Skelton keeping and he picked up the first down for Southern so the Jaguars will move the sticks and keep the drive going. They got to put something on the board this time he fakes it to Washington. Skelton has a lot of room out in front of him still on his feet. Skelton steps out of bounds at about the 11 yard line but he did a great job of reading that play pulling that football out and then making a big play for the Jaguar out and not even have that decision to make third down and seven to go for the Jaguars. Skelton breaks out of the pocket, still looking downfield, still on his feet, and then he's going to be hit short of the first down. Five-yard field goal. Good snap, good hold. Have a flag down on the play, though. The kick was good, but there is a flag on the field. Kick it deeper and try to get field position. So Southern goes to the little pooch kick, and it's Matthews, third and one. For a McNeese first down, Hutterson takes the handoff, and he just powers his way forward to the first down. After they took it down this one right here, but how much time? Well, man, no, they won't. I guess. It's, yeah, no. Yeah, that's it. That's it. So Cowboys, like we said, came in here, and, and, and Southern is a very tough place to play. I mean, this is a tough stadium to play in, and the Jaguars are extremely tough to beat here at home. And then tonight in the second half, uh, a lot of mistakes, and the Cowboys just took advantage of the opportunities that they had that Southern didn't.